In today's video, I show you how to green screen in OBS for live streaming. So as you can see behind me, this is Unreal Tournament. Uh, one of my favorite games of all time. A lot of fond memories with this game. Uh, so everything you see here is happening live or Pursuto live, whatever. I didn't do anything in uh, Premiere or Vegas or After Effects. This is all happening through OBS. I do have a green screen, but I'm going to show you how to really customize it and get it just right. What's going on, guys? Uh, I'm going to preface this entire video by saying the specific settings you need to set are based upon your lighting conditions. If your green screen is rather dark, you're going to have a little bit more trouble getting it just right. If your green screen is very bright, it might be easier. You might not need my settings. So regardless of what happens, you're going to need to customize this and play around with it. But let's get started. Okay, first and foremost, you can see on my screen there's two copies of me. The left hand side is the preview, exactly what a viewer would see. The right hand side is my effects panel in the filter setting of OBS. Now to get to this, let me actually uh, right click and you click filters. That's all you got to do. And it'll open up this panel on the right side right here. Now, <clears throat> let me show you the difference between a normal standard setting and customizing it. Now you can see on the right side, it doesn't look so bad, but on the left side, you can actually really see that it's really not keying out enough. Not by a long shot. Now, if I undo that and go to my customized one, it's practically perfect. I can put any background I want behind it and it'll look great. Now, let's actually start playing with it so I can show you a little bit what you have to do. Here we go. So similarity is how much of that green color do you want to try to kill? Now, I can go here, but then you start seeing some of the effects on the shirt. So you go too far in one direction, you start getting breakup. Then we go down, and you don't have enough. Now, what I found from my specific setup is um, the smoothness, as helpful as it is, it can cause issues. So I like to drop it low and try to get as clean of a result as I can without using smoothness. Now already you can see, holy crap, uh, right there, it's almost perfect. I am a little um, vampirishly gr gray, but what are you gonna do? Okay, so now let's say, I don't know, 42, 42. That's the setting I like for my setup. What color spill is here for is when I drop it all the way, I don't know if you could see this, there's a little green outline around me. Now all color spill is gonna try to do is detect green itself mostly the outlines but some of the main image too as you can see how gray i get uh, and it's going to try to um, desaturate it so at least you blend into backgrounds better and you don't have a a glaringly obvious green outline uh, now for me from my setup i put it on about 65 but again as i said to start the video you're going to have to customize it now you do have some other settings here like contrast but me, I go for zero. Okay, you have brightness, same thing. If you're too dark or if you want more of that, uh, I don't know what you would call it. Depends on the game, your your, your environment, obviously. 0, 0.00 <clears throat> and your gamma, which is a scale of brightness and contrast. Again, you're gonna have to play with this and get this right. I can't give you the magic settings because there is no magic setting. It's all based on your environment and what you're dealing with. <clears throat> now, some of the other things you're going to have to deal with is I like to use a color correction after the fact. And you can see the difference. This is this is very washed out, but the color correction just brings up the brightness, cleans it up. And I'm just really all I'm doing is I'm lowering the brightness a little bit, raising the contrast and raising the the the, the, la, 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 the gamma. And then I add a crop because without the crop, you can actually see half of the room where the green screen is not covering so I add the crop and that that cleans it right up no problem and the crop is fairly easy you just go up and down and and it literally just chops off the edges and that's pretty much it I'm good to go I can do a video and it's not a problem uh, but you know as always guys hopefully this video has helped you and please as always if you like what you see and you want more of these types of videos, 
Do me a favor, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.